Hello, my friends. Welcome back to the Salty Seas, the ship. So, when we left off last episode, we had come to this island and talked to a little NPC who is currently to my right. And he was like, find the treasure, bring it back, R. And he's like, uh, well, dude, you gave me no shovel. So I did take, uh, between last episode and this one, I went and looked it up. And figured out how to make a shovel. I'm lucky to have had the supplies to do it. So I scoured and scoured and scoured the island. And X marks the spot. It's a very small X, and I walked past it like three times. Aha, so you right click and it says Desert Island Treasure Cache Received. Um, a small once buried cache of treasure from a desert island. You can turn this unopened treasure to a hunter for reward. All right, let's do that. So yeah, we were still trying to make our way across the map um, to that one map location, and we just keep getting sidetracked along the way. We'll eventually make it. But you know, when you see pirate ships and stuff like this, you know, you feel obligated to stop. Mm -hmm. He looks at you with a blank stare and says nothing. Give treasure. Ah, oh, you scared me. Mmm, treasure. Here's your boom stuff. Volatile catalyst discovered. Keep a treasure eye on the ground. Okay. Are you serious? Come on, dude. You got to be kidding me, right? A small powder that can increase the explosiveness of volatile ore. This is an optional crafting component when making bombs. It is not consumed. Okay. Are you telling me I can make bombs now? Because I don't have a recipe for bombs. I'm just, uh, just randomly clicking here for a second just to see, uh, maybe it needs a fuse? How about some coal? No? Alright, well, apparently I have the components to make bombs, but not the knowledge. You were semi-helpful, but honestly I'd like to put an arrow through your face. I wonder, I'm just curious what would happen if I did put an arrow through his face. Yeah, we'll let him go. We'll let him go. So, we were on that island, and we never found the pirate captain to loot his ship. I'm almost curious enough to wonder, you know, if, uh, if I should go back and try again. But... Let's check this map. Check this map. Uh, 20 east, 1 north. I believe that was the location. I think this is the one we're at right now. So, we will check our sextant and see where we are to this. Because this is the Battlemaster Settlement. We've been trying to get here past couple episodes. Um... And maybe we can find a trader there, because we got lots of stuff to, to unload to the trader. I mean, it's a good thing to give you lots of inventory space. And, you know, these survival sandbox games, that is the most annoying thing, is not having enough room. So, 20 east, 1 north. Alright. I'm at 8 east, 0 north. Guys, y'all know my uh, navigational skills in this game are very poor. And, and let's be honest, my navigational skills in any game are very poor. So, I'll do the best I can. 
Let's get back to our ship over here. Looks like it, uh... I don't remember parking so far out. But, you know, in real life I do the same too. Um, I'll park in the back of a parking lot. And, uh, yeah, mostly just because I don't feel like fighting the retards at the front of Walmart to get a good parking space. I'll take that extra two minutes to walk and not get hit by a car. Because that has actually happened to me. Uh, you know, loading the groceries in the car and somebody pulled up in front of me, hit the front of my van, and hit me. So, yeah, true stories, you can't make these things up. But, let's get on over here to our pirate ship. Come on, pirate ship. Lower the sail, lower the sail. Aha, it worked. <laughs> look, look, lava boost. Seriously, you should fix that. As funny as it is, you should fix that. It's uh it's kind of messed up there. Uh anyway, what we're gonna do guys is uh I'm gonna go ahead and set sail to uh to that island. If we find something in the meantime, I will hop back on. But it does take a good little bit to sail across the map, especially with my navigation skills. So I'll catch you back in just a second. Alright guys, I believe that uh, this is the island right here. We were supposed to go to 20 east, 0 north. And our current location is 19 east, 1 north. And if we were to continue heading with our ship, it would probably have put us dead on. I made it most of the way here through the night but uh, ended up drifting a little southwards which was, yeah, it wasn't too bad, but um, I had to make a little correction. I went ahead and uh, slept in my bed to make it daylight just so uh, I could get my bearings straight again because, uh, you know, these islands are kind of hard to see at night from a distance, so but, you know, we made it over here. Didn't take me too long. Uh, this ship actually seems to move faster than the large ship. But it is what it is. We got all our storage on the on the large pirate ship there. And it looks like there's something on top of this island. I'm not sure. Yeah, I, I stare terribly. Y'all can tell me how bad I drive. I don't care. I'm just going to swim for it. Cannot equip a sword while swimming. Okay. Are you serious, boat? Are you serious? I just tried to get you to turn that way. Whatever. Good job, boat. Oh, it's just grass. Okay, whatever. Whatever. I'll put all the boats out. I don't care. We can get them back. I just need you to sail me straight across the water so I don't have to swim anyway. Now, this said it was a settlement. And... Yeah. This kind of looks like a pirate to me. No, 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 no. Don't get all the way up there. Don't, no. Stop. I want to check my location. 20 east, 1 north. This has got to be the island. But it said settlement. And these look like pirates. I was thinking like a town with friendly people when it said settlement. That flag may indicate otherwise though. Oh, he says, it says pirate battle master. Hey, can you stop running? Dude ran for the hills. Okay, so we know that uh, 
Battlemaster settlement is not a friendly settlement. Good to know. Well, I guess let's scroll around the island here. How come they can chop trees and I can't? I'm calling hacks. Cheaters. Well, I mean, this is uh, definitely different, you know. Different textures on the ground and whatnot. I could really use me some more hardwood and hardstone. They got flags everywhere. Look at these things. Chopping all kinds of trees down. Yeah, if you could run guide, that would be great. It would also be great if we could figure out how to make this, uh, <clears throat> these bombs. That would be cool. Because apparently we have the stuff to make them. I just don't have the recipe. Thank you, white flower. White flowers are good. I need more of them. Yep, thank you. I don't like your flag, it's ugly. I suppose if we followed the flags, it would lead us to uh, maybe pirate treasure or something, but I will take this hardwood. Yes, sir. Cause I believe it was what the hardwood and hardstone to make the storage chest on the ship. And I would like to have some more storage chests. I don't like running around with everything in my inventory. It's it's one thing that is bothering me. And it's it's you know kind of OCD about you know having my stuff put away and everything else like that. But we'll get it eventually. We will get it eventually. So there's my pirate ship, there's my boat, and my raft is over there, all in a row. I deploy all the boats and all the ships. Alright, well, apparently I came over here for one boulder. Which is fine. It gave me some hard stone. The whole running in this game, it, it really... It really gets on my nerves. Unable to use this item right now. Fine. I didn't want to eat your magic mushroom anyway. Get the sword out. Just in case we run across some pirate douchebags. No. Nope. Oh, oh, hello. There's three of them. Alright. Alright, back's turned. See if I can just get this one guy here. Alright, I got him to break off. It's battle time. I think I made a mistake. Yeah, I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Don't kill me. 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 Yeah, here's the mistake that I made. I didn't save. Oh boy, that didn't save. And let's see, that's deer scent, night vigor potion. That's actually kind of something I could probably use right now. Put that on one. But I have. I have one of those. Can I eat some food? 
Two full. Two full. Unable to use. Can't eat it. Uh, Alright. Fine. Well, we saved. Let's go back. He ran away. Why is he running away? Alright, look, he's trying to kite me over to the rest of the pirates. Uh, that's not cool, bro. Come on over here and face your fears. I'm not chasing you. There's no way that I'm chasing you. He's just running around, so... Um... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna end up having to make regular arrows. Darn it. Come on. Alright, where'd my regular arrows go? Look, see, there's a whole settlement up there. I just actually noticed that while I was in my crafting menu here. Alright, so we got 11 arrows now. Let's hope we don't attract any of those guys. Up. What are they doing? Yeah, we're going straight for the guy we've already injured. Come on, man. That was 56 damage. Yeah, die. Give me something good. I need something for health. Oh my gosh, he's got a pirate ration. Alright, well, we're going to leave them guys over there. We're going to quick save. We can check out these little huts up here. I was really hoping that it was going to be like a trader because, man, the other trader is, he's a good ways away. I heard a harm. Alright, yeah, get me down here by the water. These guys are tough. Ah, oh, I died. Kinda knew that was coming. Kinda knew it was coming. I should deploy my raft right behind me when I get over there. Or actually I can see him now. Was he a different guy? <coughs> Come on. <coughs> I need you to die. <coughs> Don't kill me. He's got a bandage. Nice. Let's use our bandage. Healing my wounds. I actually think we can maybe make bandages. It probably would not be a bad idea, being as uh, I'm pretty frequent on the deaths. Pretty frequent. Alright. 
Let's see how much health that bandage is going to give us. While we're waiting, we might as well harvest this boulder. And hope no pirates come along. Alright, one bandage does uh, almost half health. So we'll use that one. Is it going to let me eat? Uh, no, I'm always too full to eat that. Come on, I don't care if I'm too full and it's going to waste some of it. I want a full health bar or hunger bar. Both. Oh. Hello, mister. I'm stuck in the tree. You're the captain. Your name is Bobo. <laughs> All right, Captain Bobo escaped the tree. Oh man, he hits hard. He hits really hard. Oh no, no Bobo. I liked it better when you were stuck on the tree. Well then. What can you do? What can you do? Oh, I forgot to save after I killed that guy. At least we're not, you know, super way far back. Alright. Really? I was sitting here holding right click. Give me a break, game. Now this guy's gonna kill me? Come on. I'm dead. Oh well, guys. We are going to continue our epic pirate battle in the next episode. We have reached our time for the day, guys. Like always, appreciate you coming, hanging out with me, watching my videos. All my little links are in the video description if you find something you'd like to look at. And until next time, guys, have a good day and take it easy.